Welcome back to Midnight Sun. Egg, kichit. Let's see how the story unfolds today. Hunter, good to see you. Yes, hello. Protecting the Hydra device. Spidey. By the end that Let's see. Can we get back this artifact? Whatever that device is, Hydra would rather destroy it than allow us to capture it for analysis. Don't waste any time. Take them out before they can do any serious damage. 
Those soldiers are targeting the device. Do whatever it takes to stop them. to see Okay, that was pretty cool. Need one of those. I could be the invisible man. Invisible man. I'm on it. choice. One's for you! What? It must be tough losing all the time. For like... decades. Keeping score at home. Hydra is in control of the situation. Doing well so far. Up for some girl talk. a serious predicament for you. Not 
done. Everything according to plan. You've got incoming Hydra. You know what to do. I saw a move like that once, centuries ago. Not to brag, but I feel pretty good right now. Let's just get this over with. Five enemies interrogate. We're mostly alive, they're mostly not. So, yeah, we're good. I'm gonna get ya! Now. Okay. Every 
Everything looks good so far. Oh, this should be good. This should help. By my side. need to practice looks like we've acquired some new hardware courtesy of Hydra good work yep what and we go oh nice Okay. Da hoy. I sugo shan. Oi mak tu jo to koi mi. Mama, ne, yen nak ne. Cioccolati, va. Non mi sono cioccolati. Covi, va. Ha detto che io sono una cosa. Covi. C'è cloccio un covi, no? Covi. Non è covi. Esatto. A few of us are meeting up tonight. It's a book club. You're probably busy, but if not, the other said I should invite you. Sure. A book club? Yeah, I didn't figure the great and powerful hunter would be into a book club. If it is worth reading, I'm interested. Yeah. All our books are worth reading. Anyway, I'm headed to the meeting. I doubt it's your thing, but if you're interested, you could tag along. Sure. After you. Okay then. The club meeting. Oh, ho, ho. Steve Rogers. I know about as much as you. Blade put this together. He's the person to ask. Blade's giving you the stink eye. Or maybe he doesn't like the punch. <laughs> Either way, I think he wants to speak with you. Okay. Here's how this works. We pick out a book, we read the book, and then next meeting we talk about the book. Okay. It's my turn to pick, so give me a minute. I need to narrow it down. What kind of book is a book club book? The good ones, that's the plan at least. Did you already talk about today's book? Well, no, there isn't one for today. Oh. What is the best book you have read so far? Uh, none. <laughs> you have not read any books, but you are starting a book club? Hunter, I've read half the books in the library. I have too many favorites to list. I meant I have no book club favorites yet. You are being evasive, and I do not know why. This is technically our first meeting. 
Huh. Oh, I thought this was a regular thing you did. Yeah, I want it to be. Doesn't matter how sharp your weapons are if your mind is as dull as a brick. Just give me some space. I need to find the right book if I'm going to. I need to pick the right book, okay? Okay. All right. This is the first book club I've been to that didn't devolve into a knockdown drag out fight. <laughs> Must have been some book club. Yeah. A few years back, Bruce and Tony started an Avengers literature circle. First book chosen was Banner's favorite. Nice. Tony hated it. Said it was the worst poetry he'd ever read. That a mascara blinded lab monkey could have written it better. I still don't know what that means. Turned out, it wasn't Banner's favorite book. It was Hulk's. Uh -huh. Oh no. Oh, we lost yes. two floors of Avengers Tower before he calmed down. <laughs> what happened next? Black Widow invoked the this is why we can't have nice things rule and banned book clubs from meeting at the tower. I see. I hope I have time for this. I used to be in one of these with my friend Jess, but it fell apart. What happened? I got reassigned. She had a kid. Aliens invaded. The usual. I see. Aliens? Yeah. It's been a busy decade. Alright. I made my decision. Okay. So what is it going to be? The first book we'll read for Book Club will be The Art of War by Sun Tzu. Ooh, a classic. Yep, that's an old book. Way older than The Hunter. Ah, The Art of War. I read that when I was 12. Well, then you could reread it. See if you gain a new perspective. Our time is tight, I get it. But stop by the library and read the book before the next meeting. Okay. But I hope you read the whole thing. This book is one of my favorites. The katana gave that away. <laughs> yeah, I'm always around if you want to chat about it. Ah, uh, I'll save it for the next book club. I could chat about it. Uh, nah, I'm good. Hunter. I admit, I like the low-pressure approach we're taking to book club. These things should be fun and informative. Yes. Not the high-stakes powder keg of the Stark and Banner book club regime. What did you think of the meeting? Seems like a great way to get to know each other. What do you think about Blade's choice of book? It got me thinking about a book I can choose. It'll have to be a good one to match Blade's pick. See you later. Next uh -huh. time, then. I think that went well. Carol seemed to enjoy herself. What do you think? Blade, did you start a book club so Carol would join it? <laughs> no. Yes. Sort of. We were talking about books, and I may have suggested the two of us read a book and talk about it. Captain America overheard and expressed interest. Carol said I was starting a book club, and he asked if he could join. Nice. Then what? What was I supposed to do? Say no to Captain America? Knowledge is the key to a person's heart. Yeah. You think? It might be the key to Carol's heart. The key to mine is a silver stake, so you got the better end of the deal. Glad you came, Hunter. But don't forget to do the reading. All right, I will. I'm not kidding.
head refrain. What are you up so late reading? The twisted brain drippings of that psycho Faustus? Aww. This journal is like a love letter to Aleister Crowley, the Necronomicon, Jack the Ripper, and Charles Manson. All remixed into some nightmarish open mic poetry. I'm going to be up all night trying to make sense of it. See if it helps us find our way back into the sanctum. Okay. You are exhausted, Carol. Get some rest. You can crack Faustus's code tomorrow. It's not that I don't appreciate the sentiment, Hunter, but I'll tap out when I'm ready. Okay. Besides, if I went to sleep right now, this nightmare juice would be sure to terrorize me with bad dreams. And when I say bad dreams, I don't mean Lovecraftian demons or Cenobites. I mean being stuck at a 12-hour poetry slam in the East Village. You know, real horror. Listen to this crap. Lilith, your name is a black hole for men like me to lose their souls. How I await to be suffocated in your arms. Choke on the dark tendrils of your hair. Murder me, goddess, and I will help you murder this dimension. These are just the ramblings of a madman. No rhyme or reason to be found. There must be something helpful here. Well, I ought to get back to burning the midnight oil. I got about 400 pages to go of this crap. Uh, I'll let you know what I find out. Okay, Carol. Oh, hey, Hunter. Curious. Like one yeah, the book. to have you with us don't ask me how many times Iron Man has asked me to charge his phone hunter stay a while <laughs> 